Today, we're going to show you exactly what it's like to spend 24 hours on a five-star luxury cruise here in Hao Long Bay, Vietnam. And if you can't tell already, we are so excited to share this with you. We're on a 10-day trip around northern Vietnam to discover some of the most beautiful destinations in this country, and Hao Long Bay is definitely one of them. Voted a UNESCO World Heritage Site and known for its beautifully tall limestone pillars and emerald green waters, we're going to be exploring this area aboard the Luxury Monterey Cruise Liner. This tour has been organized by Vietnam Escape Tours. They picked us up at our hotel in Hanoi this morning and drove us two hours east to the port. We boarded a smaller boat for a 30 minute ride to the area where our cruise liner was anchored. Hello everyone, welcome to Montreux Luxury Cruise. And I must admit, it's very luxurious actually. We just got onto the boat and the whole team waved at us and greeted us as soon as we got on. Then we walked and we got some cool towels for our hands. We got welcome drinks. And then while we were walking up the stairs, they were throwing rose petals down at us. How cute is that? First stop on the boat is to get lunch and it looks amazing. There's flowers everywhere. Everything is so elegant and beautiful. I'm really excited for the next 24 hours. Included in your room rate is the four meals and all activities. Beverages and spa treatments are separate. I can't believe there's a king size bed on this Ooh. cruise. Wow. We've got a bathtub, we've got a bathtub. Got a bathtub? Oh my gosh. <gasps> Stop that now. Hey. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> Guys, I've got really sore cheeks from smiling so much. This is so beautiful. Like, literally, my cheeks are so sore. This is so beautiful, I can't. Oh. What did we do to deserve this? Really? It's unreal. <laughs> okay, let's give you a proper quick room tour. We were not expecting this at all. I don't know what we were expecting, but it really wasn't this. And this has exceeded every expectation that we had of this entire cruise. This room is absolutely massive. We've got a double king size bed. This balcony, oh my word. Two seats, real plants. All the plants you'll see on this entire ship are real. We've got beautiful blackout curtains. Look at all this space, guys. We've got a little dressing table area. We've got a mini bar. They've given us water, beers, and sodas. A full plate of fresh fruit and tea, coffee, and all of that. You'll notice that all the bottles on the ship are glass, and that's because they have a zero plastic rule. When this runs out, you have to take it to reception and they'll refill it up with water for you. That is amazing. We are really happy with Mon Sherry doing that because unfortunately there is a ton of plastic in the ocean itself. And I guess this is a way to try and curb that and prevent it. We just had to mention that because that's really the only downside about this. Anyway, let's carry on. We've got an air conditioner, a TV, and what else do we have? Anything interesting? Okay, some drawers. <laughs> We've got robes as well as life jackets in case we need that. And then the bathroom. I cannot. <gasps> it's got a bathtub and it's got jets. Oh my word. And they give you shower gel, shampoo and conditioner, all sorts of stuff. Razors, toothbrush, cotton buds, shower cap, hair dryer. We've got a mirror to do our makeup. I don't even know what that is. We've got beautiful towels. A beautiful toilet with a built-in bum gun. That's when you know it's luxury, guys. And then a... Just an awesome shower, actually really, really big. And some more shampoo conditioner and stuff there. This is insane. When we came aboard, we got given an itinerary for the next 24 hours. There's quite a lot of things happening. We've had our lunch. We're gonna go kayaking shortly. But let me just tell you what else is planned. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, we would like to inform that it's time for the kayaking and swimming. So you wanna join us, could you please watch the reception area on deck one, so be there. Thank you very much. Thank you. After the kayaking, there's also a dinner, sunset drinks, there's a cocktail party a little bit later, and then tomorrow morning we have the Tai Chi 
and we're going to go see a cave but all of those activities are completely optional if you want to just spend your time lying on this bed and looking at the beautiful view all day long that you can do too oh i missed my room already why I have a bubble look bar. at what's in front of you I, oh, I know i know it's beautiful but so is my room how fantastic is this weather and we've got a bit of a blue sky going on it's right in the middle of rainy season and we've actually been having the hardest time with weather here it's the middle of august and it's been raining quite a lot in the northern vietnam part but how lucky are we to have wonderful weather and no rain but i mean even if it did rain in halong bay while you're on a cruise ship i don't think it's the worst in the world you just jump in the bubble bath have a champagne or a beer and just relax it's fab it's honestly fab It is very impressive. Very cool. Yay. We've had a nice little trip around the bay on the kayaks. We've sweated a ton and now I've found the pool on this cruise and I'm definitely going to get in right now. I don't think we actually mentioned it, but this is our first cruise ever for both Rhett and I. We've never been on one before and I love it. We both Love it so much, it's so much fun! After the kayaking and the little swim, we just came back to our room and hit the sack basically. This bed is so comfortable, the pillows are top quality. It's so peaceful and calming being on this boat, I must say. I love being on the water. Rhett's loving being on the water, but I think my stomach is not loving it. It's a little upset to be honest. I don't know what's going on. We're not moving at all. We're dead still. But we have gotten dressed up a little bit because it's time to go and see the cooking demonstration upstairs. And the sun is setting right now, so let's go. The first step, you are put around like this to make it shorter. <laughs> The staff are just showing us how to make spring rolls and there's vermicelli noodles in there, mushrooms, carrots, chicken, egg and lots of different colours. That's why it's actually called spring rolls because it looks like spring inside it. It's very cute. I'm making my own spring roll now. This is mine. Yay! And then this little buddy will go and get deep fried in oil and we'll eat them later. Spring rolls are finally ready and we've paired them with a nice mango daiquiri. We just watched the most insane pink sunset go down. Oh my word, the landscape here is absolutely stunning. It's actually party hour behind me if you can't tell. Mmm. <laughs> if you come on the cruise, you'll notice it's actually buy one get one free from 5pm. Nice. It's now time for dinner and the cruise ship has set up happy birthday like balloons for everyone that's having a birthday this week and then they've set up anniversary like decorations for anyone having an anniversary. They're like going above and beyond. Even the decorations on our table are so cute. There's shells and rose petals and everything. Just such a vibe being on this cruise. The staff are so lovely. Everyone's so everyone's having the best time. It's just great. And by the way guys, there is South African wine on the menu. Maybe we should get a glass. We don't really drink, but maybe. <laughs> but yeah, I'm very excited for dinner. I think it's going to be a good one tonight. Right, we're back in our room. Dinner was absolutely superb. We had two starters, two mains, and a dessert. It was absolutely amazing. The duck starter, the prawns, the fish. 
it was just fantastic the food has been so good and the hospitality of the staff has been next level i can't even believe it but they took it upon themselves to host these little celebrations for the birthday people and for the people having an anniversary it's very thoughtful anyway time to hit the sack we'll see you in the morning for a fun activity good morning the sun has risen and so have we it's time to go and do tai chi <laughs> i just came up with that right now in my head <laughs> it's good let's go tai chi Good morning, there's another excursion this morning at 7.30 after breakfast going to be going to the cave we've decided to give it a skip because we went to Ninbin and we spent a bit of time in the caves there and we really just want to enjoy this boat and the luxury and maybe just stay in the room and relax on the patio the Tai Chi this morning was really good it's good to stretch in the morning and yeah just really a good fun time the scenery the music our lady wearing the outfit I love it breakfast is basically over but let me show you what there was on offer we had Cornflakes, different juices, a bunch of fruits, yogurt, some cakes, olives, pickles, cold meats and cheeses, then there's the bread section with jam, nice toaster, and over here you can get some flour, and they also make some eggs, coffee, and hot foods, tomatoes, hash browns, bao buns, sausages, bacon, so very very good variety. is why you don't go on the excursion because you have the pool to yourself while everybody is out gallivanting we are just here on the deck by ourselves it's like a private pool but yeah i'm excited to jump in and just chill i realize i actually didn't show you the boat so let me take you on a quick tour we're currently outside here at the little deck and swimming pool area and then right above us, we've got more lounges for relaxing and the bar and an area to do the stretching and where we did our Tai Chi this morning. And then through here, we basically have Hi. the restaurant. Hello, good morning. <laughs> Downstairs, we've got cabins. Two cabins here, a whole bunch of cabins down this alley and there's two floors with cabins. I think there's about 20 or so rooms. So the it takes about 50 people on this boat, so not really not that many, it's very exclusive. Actually quite nice not having too many people on the boat. And then we've got two little equipment here for doing some exercises. There's a big patio over here. Behind me is literally the best suite on the boat, it's very, very luxurious. Even though our room is fantastic, there is a little bit of a higher level up on this boat if you are looking for a nicer, more luxurious experience. And then... There is a spa. You can come get a couple's massage here. You can get your nails done. And just do a nice little bit of pampering. Lots of facilities and things to do on this boat. Our amazing tour agency, Vietnam Escape Tours, organized this boat trip for us and actually our entire Northern Vietnam itinerary as well. And if you haven't seen those videos yet, I'll link them above here. And I'll also link Vietnam Escape Tours down in the description and the pinned comment. You guys can book your tour through them. They've been utterly amazing and honestly we think traveling around northern vietnam through a tour agency is the best they take care of all the transport all the planning the pickups everything it's so much easier and super efficient doing it that way so go check the description and the pinned comments and that's going to be it for our time on the monterey luxury liner it's been world class they even gave us a second breakfast before we departed back to shore and once again we have to commend the incredible staff they made this trip truly unforgettable <laughs> thank you Tim, bye bye. Thank you very much, thank you. Stay tuned for the next video. We're going to be showing you how to plan the perfect trip around northern Vietnam.